Know the causes and how to get rid of cellulite. Cellulite is often a complaint because of its disturbing appearance for some people. The causes of cellulite can vary and are generally difficult to prevent. Even so, cellulite can be disguised in various ways, ranging from natural ways to medical treatments. Cellulite is streaks resembling an orange peel that are commonly seen on the thighs, arms, hips, buttocks and stomach. In more severe conditions, cellulite can make the skin look bumpy. However, mild cellulite is only visible when the skin is pinched or pulled. Causes of cellulite you need to know. Cellulite is caused by a pile of fat between the connective tissue that connects the skin to the muscle layer underneath. This fat deposit pushes the skin upwards, while the connective tissue holds it in place. This condition causes the surface of the skin to appear bumpy and uneven. Here are some factors that can increase your risk of developing cellulite. 1. Gender. Although it can be experienced by anyone, women are more at risk of experiencing cellulite than men. This is due to the structure of female connective tissue which is more easily filled and stretched by fat. 2. Hormones. Hormones are also one of the causes of cellulite. The hormones estrogen, insulin, thyroid, prolactin, and noradrenaline are hormones that play a role in the formation of cellulite. In women, the hormone estrogen has a role in regulating the storage of body fat that will be needed during pregnancy and childbirth. This causes fat to naturally accumulate in the breasts, thighs, and buttocks. A woman's risk of developing cellulite generally increases when the hormone estrogen is high, for example during pregnancy, breastfeeding, and taking birth control pills for a long time. Meanwhile, in men, the hormone testosterone is a hormone that plays a role in the production of cellulite. Low testosterone can make a man more at risk of developing cellulite. 3. Genetics Genetic factors are also one of the causes of cellulite. If any of your family members have cellulite, your risk of developing cellulite will be greater. This is because genetics and one's ethnicity determine the rate of metabolism and distribution of fat. 4. Age. Increasing age can also increase your risk of developing cellulite. The reason is, the layers of skin will weaken, thin, and stretch more easily with age. This in turn can make cellulite more easily formed and visible. Apart from the several causes of cellulite above, there are also several other factors that can exacerbate cellulite. However, you may be able to control these factors, including drastic changes in body weight, poor diet, smoking habits, skin health that is not maintained, and minimal muscle mass. How to get rid of cellulite Cellulite can generally be reduced or reduced, but it can be quite difficult to get rid of completely. If you are among those who are bothered by the presence of cellulite, there are two ways you can do it to minimize it, namely the natural way and the medical way. How to get rid of cellulite naturally Here are various ways to disguise cellulite with simple steps that can be done at home. Lose weight by exercising and adopting a healthy diet. Wear stockings regularly, to prevent fluid buildup in cellulite which makes it more obvious. Do massage therapy, so that blood circulation is smooth and fluid buildup in the cellulite area is reduced. Stop or reduce smoking habits. How to get rid of cellulite medically. If you have taken natural ways to get rid of cellulite and you still fail to get rid of cellulite, here are the medical methods you can take, of course, after consulting directly with your doctor. 
using retinol cream for plus or minus six months to reduce cellulite. Perform cryolipolysis to reduce and remove fat tissue in cellulite. Undergoing laser therapy to melt fat, increase collagen production, tighten skin, and reduce fluid deposits in cellulite areas. Undergoing ultrasound therapy to reduce fat deposits and tighten the skin. If you pay attention, the main cause of cellulite is something that cannot be avoided. So, you could say cellulite is something natural and nothing to worry about. Even so, you can refine the appearance of your skin in the ways above. If you want to get treatment or medical action to get rid of cellulite, you should first consult a doctor. That way, your doctor can suggest a way to get rid of cellulite that suits your condition.